Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, thanks for joining us today for PTS's uh, Public Safety and Public Administration webinar. Uh, my name is Howie Heckman. I'm one of the developers here at PTS. I'm going to be uh, walking you through a little bit of, uh, of our Tracer Plus desktop and Tracer Plus uh, applications, talking, talking about converting uh, existing paper forms into electronic mobile uh, data collection tools uh, with kind of a focus on public safety and public administration. So I'm going to actually start off the uh, webinar uh, showing everyone a, a, an existing form that we had converted uh, using our Tracer Plus desktop design tool and uh, kind of how we went step by step through taking it from a, a paper form to an electronic version uh, using our Tracer Plus desktop tool. So uh, on my screen here, I'm going to go ahead and open up uh, the a overhead line inspection form. Uh, this is used to go out and do overhead line inspections. Uh, you can see from the form here, it's kind of a complicated form. In fact, there's instructions on the back page as to how to fill it out. Um, but you can see it's a pretty complicated form. There's a lot of, uh, a lot of room for error here in both uh, handwriting and then transcription later on into a back-end database system. Um, so uh, using the electronic version, we're able to both simplify this form as well as validate a lot of the data that, uh, that's coming back into the system. So rather than going out in the field filling out this form uh, to do the inspections, uh, maybe something was filled out incorrectly, uh, maybe something was in, uh, not, wasn't legible coming back to the officer headquarters. Uh, with Tracer Plus and Tracer Plus Desktop, we're able to convert this form pretty quickly and easily into a mobile data collection tool. So down here, I have a uh, screen sharing application that's connected to a mobile device. And I have here the finished uh, inspection form that, was, that we converted from this paper form on the mobile device. So I'm going to go ahead and click on this and open up the form. And once this opens up here, you can see all of the items that you see on the paper form were included within the electronic version. So really, we went through, took every piece of information from the paper form, converted it using our Tracer Plus desktop tool, and then pushed it down to this mobile device. So you can see we kind of uh, turned it into more of a wizard type feel, where you're filling out sections of the form. You can go to the next section here for doing the different inspection items of the, the lines. Um, and you can go through the whole process. Uh, it even captures GPS coordinates just kind of as, as a validation at the end of the form. Uh, but everything on the form is validated uh, at the time of inspection uh, and will only allow the inspector to save that data to the, to the database. And then at the end of the day, he can come back and sync that up with his back-end database system or maybe an Excel spreadsheet. But all of the data is uh, validated on the handheld, there's no errors then when it comes back to the home office, and there's no errors when it's being uh, entered from the, the paper form into the back-end system, because that's all done through our syncing tools to get that back into uh, the, the database or Excel spreadsheet. OK, so that's uh, kind of a, a pre-configured application uh, that we did. We did that all within our Tracer Plus desktop tool. So here you can see this is Tracer Plus. It's the, it's the software that runs on the mobile device. Um, it's, it's used by the guys out in the field. And it's, it's fully configured with the mobile forms. And in this case, it just has the one overhead line inspection form, which you can see here. Um, but you can go ahead and add others. So I'm going to jump over to the design tool, uh, which is Tracer Plus Desktop. This is the tool where we actually took the paper form created a, an electronic version of it, and then pushed it down to that connected mobile device here. So you can see I have the uh, overhead line inspection project loaded up within Tracer Plus Desktop. And on the left-hand side, you can see our one inspection form. If you select that inspection form, you can see how all we did was name the form, add all of the fields of information that we needed to based on what was in the, in the paper form added different validation settings to validate all of our data on the handheld so that not, none of this coming back to the office is uh, incorrect data and everything's validated. Uh, and really just controlling how all of the data that we're collecting on the device, it's valid, uh, validating it and also setting up or uh, creating it as simple as possible in, uh, for, the, for the inspector out in the field. Um, once we added all of the fields that we needed on the form, we would ju then jump over to our form designer. And here is where we actually have our drag and drop tool, where we just kind of uh, moved around the checkboxes, uh, created these navigation buttons to give it a wizard-type feel, 
and really just created a, uh, a, an electronic version of the paper form that was sent to us. So you can see here it's a fully configured form all done within this drag and drop utility. And then once you're uh, all finished up designing the mobile form, all you would do is within Tracer Plus Desktop, just go to Tools, Build, De Build Deploy, and now this form that we've created will be pushed down to the connected mobile device and you're ready to go to do the overhead line inspections. Okay, so that's, that's kind of a pre-configured one that we, we finished from start to finish by taking the paper form, uh, creating it within Tracer Plus Desktop, and then pushing it down to our mobile device uh, so that all that data is validated, uh, checked on the, on the mobile device, and then at the end of the day it can be synced back into, into the back-end system with no errors. So that's a, uh, a completed form. The next thing I wanted to actually jump into was our online solution center. This uh, project here we actually uh, have available on the online solution center and it's, it's free to download and trial uh, by anybody that would t uh, like to take a look at it. So our, our solution center is really an online library of all of these different forms that we've created and you can download, download the, uh, them to Tracer Plus Desktop kind of modify them if you need to and push them out to the mobile device. So I'm going to go ahead and open up the uh, Solution Center now and then uh, to do that what all you'd have to do is uh, open up Tracer Plus Desktop which is our free to use design tool like you see here. On the home screen or the first screen that you see when you open up the application there's a button here for search online samples and if you click on that what it does is it'll open a, uh, a little dialog that shows a bunch of different categories of the pre-configured applications that we've done uh, and that we have available on our website. This, uh, these different categories here, everything's free to download. Uh, you can navigate uh, through them, finish the import process. It'll download them to Tracer Plus Desktop, at which point you can change them if you'd like or you can uh, just push them out and start testing a, a mobile form. So I'm going to jump into the inspection form here just to show you that uh, actually the first one in that list is the overhead utility line inspection form like I just showed you. And so if anybody wanted to take a look at that form in a little bit more depth uh, and kind of play with it, maybe modify it if, if they needed to, you can actually go ahead and select that here. You can see the screenshots which match what I just showed you. And uh, go ahead, finish the import process. It'll open it up in desktop and then you can just do the tools build deploy to push it down to the mobile device. So I'm actually going to, just to show you how easy that process is, I'm going to switch over to a new project. I have here a fire extinguisher inspection demo. Uh, this this uh, project will allow you to go out and scan fire extinguishers, look up uh, descriptions about the fire extinguisher, maybe the location, and then collect a small little inspection of that fire extinguisher that you can then sync back to a back-end system. So uh, all I need to do in order to get that to my mobile device is take a look at it here. I just finished my uh, import process. You can see it gives a little description of the fire extinguisher form. Just click import. It'll download that from our website. When you click finish, it's going to open up the extinguisher management uh, application now in Tracer Plus Desktop. So you can see that it closed the, uh, the overhead line inspection project that I was working on, and now I'm ready to go with this extinguisher uh, inspection. So on the left hand side I have uh, two forms available that came with this project, unlike just the one from the uh, line inspection. Uh, the extinguisher list is actually populated, or will be populated with all of the extinguishers in our system. And then the check pressure form allows you to uh, go out and actually do the inspection. So scan the extinguisher IDs, uh, look up information about the extinguishers, and then actually perform the inspection. So if I jump to the form designer here, you can see just like uh, you saw on the, uh, within the wizard or the, the import from our solution center, you can see the screenshot. If you wanted to, you can go ahead and move this around, maybe add a company logo to customize it a little bit further, add additional fields as needed for the inspection. Um, and again, once you're complete, just go back up to the tools build deploy or you can use this build deploy down here. And you can see I have uh, that PDA connected. Okay, and when I hit deploy, it goes through a little deployment process, and when it's complete within desktop, it'll actually, uh, Tracer Plus will open up for you on the connected mobile device like you see here. And now you're ready to actually test out these new forms. So within a couple of minutes, I was able to search our, our online samples uh, for different uh, public safety or public inspection type applications, which we can customize further. 
and then open them up on the handheld to go ahead and start playing with them here. So you can see, uh, just like you saw in Tracer Plus Desktop, we now have the uh, extinguisher inspection session, and you can go ahead and start scanning items here and collecting information and doing inspections of these fire extinguishers. Okay, so um, that's kind of how quick and easy it is to download from our website. Um, all of this stuff, again, uh, you can customize the validation that's done on the handheld uh, so that you can really lock down the data that's being entered before it gets into your back-end system. So uh, this here, um, I should also mention, is the, is the mobile client, so the, the forms that the guy's using out in the field, as well as the design tool. Um, we also offer, which I'll show you in a little bit, some syncing tools that will get you this data back into your back-end system or an Excel spreadsheet, either in a batch or a wireless mode, uh, to send data to and from that your back-end database to the mobile devices. 